Hey guys, this is Kent and you're watching Diagraphics. Today we are going to draw the Indian flag inside Adobe Illustrator. The first thing you want to do is go to View, then go to Show Grid, then go to View again and Snap to Grid. Then to make it easier for ourselves, we want to change the grid size a little bit. So go to Edit, go to Preferences, go to Guides and Grid. Then we want to change grid line every to 10 millimeters. And don't worry if you're using another unit, it will automatically convert to your preferred unit. And then choose 10 as a subdivision. Click OK. Now zoom down until you see the 10 subdivisions. Then go to the pen tool. Choose one of these crosshairs right here in the top. Then go down two large squares and two small squares up and one to the right. Click once again. Then go to the middle again and go eight small squares down from here. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Click again. Now do the same thing in the other side. Now go down to the corner and unselect the stroke. Select the fill and make this one a blue color. I'm using the correct colors for the flag. If you want those two, you can download them down in the description. Then to import them into Illustrator, you go to this drop down, go to Open Swatch Library, Other Library and find them on your computer. Now go to the selection tool and select the entire shape. Then go down to the rotate tool and we want 24 of these. So now we want to rotate this shape and copy it. Do this by holding down the Alt key or the Option key on Mac and drag this blue crosshair down to this crosshair down here. A full circle is 360 degrees. So let's type this. And we want 24 of these. So divide this by 24 like this. Click the preview button and click copy. And instead of doing this 24 times, we're just going to repeat this step. You're doing this by pushing Ctrl D or Command D on Mac. Do this until you have a complete circle. Now go to the ellipse tool and draw a circle at the top of this spike. To do a complete circle, you want to hold down Shift Alt or Shift Options on Mac while dragging your mouse button. Now go to Transform, make sure the link is on and make this circle 3 millimeters wide. Now go down to the Rotate tool once again. Hold down the Alt key or the Option key on Mac and drag the blue crosshair down to the middle of all the spikes. We want the circle to go between the spikes. So we need to divide the 15 degrees by 2 and push OK. Now it's in the right place. Now go down to the blue crosshair once again. Hold down the Alt key or the Option key and click it. Now we want to copy this circle every 15 degrees. So put down 15 degrees and select copy. And once again, we want to repeat this step by pushing Ctrl D or Command D on Mac. Do this until you have a complete circle. Now go to the ellipse tool again. Go to the middle of the spikes. Hold down Shift Alt or Shift Options on Mac while dragging your mouse button. Now make a circle that reaches the tip of all the spikes. Make this a stroke instead of a fill. Now go to stroke. Select Align Stroke to Outside and make the stroke 4.3 mm wide. Now go back to the middle of the circle. Hold down Shift Alt or Shift Option and make a circle that is 6 small squares in radius. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. Make this fill instead of a stroke. Now go to the Selection tool. Select the entire chakra. Then go to Object. Go to Expand Appearance. This will make the strokes a shape instead of a stroke. Now right click and select group. Now the chakra is completed and we want to draw the flag. So go a little bit to the side. You can hold down the space key and drag with your mouse. Now select the rectangle tool. Go to one of these crosshairs and draw a rectangle that is one big square tall and four and a half big squares wide. Now go to the selection tool. Hold down the Alt key or the Option key to duplicate and make a duplication. Drag it down under. Once again, duplicate one more. Now for the top square, choose the orange or the saffron color. For the middle square, choose the white. And for the bottom square, choose the green. Select the entire flag. 
right click and select group. Then right click again, go to arrange and arrange to back because we want it behind the chakra. Now zoom out a little bit, go to the selection tool again, select the flag then hold down the shift key, select the chakra, then release the shift key and click one more time at the chakra to select it because we want the flag to align to the middle of the chakra and not the other way around. So now go to horizontal align center and vertical align center. Now the flag is totally aligned to the center of the chakra. Now unselect the shapes. Now select the flag, go to transform, make sure the reference point is marked in the middle, so not up here, but in the middle. Go to the height and type in 240 millimeters. Now zoom out, go to the selection tool, select the entire flag, right click and click group. So now you can scale the flag up and down as you wish by holding down the shift key and dragging these corners. And this is how you draw the Indian flag inside Adobe Illustrator. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up or subscribe to my channel if you want to see more of these graphic design tutorials. Thank you for watching.